I want to introduce something to you that is going to change your life and it is to have non-negotiables in your daily routine and these are things you will do them come hell or high water. You should have one non-negotiable in four areas of your life. The first one is your body and that just relates to overall either daily movement or exercise. It can be one of the two. Now for me personally the easiest one to get in it's just hitting 10,000 steps a day. If you hit 10,000 steps a day, it's gonna be, you're gonna really have to try to get fat. I mean, you must be eating straight up lard if you're staying fat on 10,000 steps a day. The overall act of doing 10,000 steps a day forces you to get outside, forces you to stay active, it forces you to stay moving so you never really get sedentary. The other area is your food. You have to have at least one non-negotiable in your food. The easiest one to do is water, but I think that's so essential because if you don't drink enough water, you're gonna die, basically. You're gonna have a horrible death and everybody's gonna suffer and all that. Water is like a non, 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 non-negotiable. But when it comes to your food, you gotta have one non-negotiable that you do. If you were to ask me, if you were to just choose one, it would be to hit your calories because that's the most important thing. The third area to have a non-negotiable is your love, how much appreciation you show others, your relationships, your close surroundings, your family, or even just your coworkers, even your clients. Are you going the extra mile? And the fourth area to have a non-negotiable in is your business slash career slash finances. And that really depends on what you do for a living. Let's say you're one of them downy realtors or something like that. Then it would be, you know, to consume at least one whole Porto's donut a day. No, I'm just kidding to go door knocking or whatever. Incorporating these non-negotiables is a good way to solidify your new level in life. And as you know, you never stay the same. Homeostasis doesn't exist. You only get better, you get worse, right? Every New Year's Eve, you always ask yourself, did I get better or worse last year? You have to level up all the time. The only time you're really at your highest point in life is five seconds before you die. And that's why you see a lot of, especially men, they peak too early, they peak in high school, and then they go buy a lifted truck with the chrome wheels and the tinted black windows and one of those you know, diesel engines that spits out the black smoke and they call you bruh.